Uh, Jonathan, do we use uh, reuse the burrs? Uh, and, and the answer is yes, we do. Uh, the diamond football burrs are pretty much indestructible unless you drop the handpiece and the burr hits the floor or the table and then it'll bend the burr and then it will be, uh, it won't be a, a nice high pitch sound when that, when that burr rotates in the handpiece. It'll be a unusual sound and it'll also, you can also see the vibration there. So you don't want to, you don't want to um, keep them if you have dropped them uh, because they'll be bent and they won't function correctly. But uh, those diamond football burrs should last uh, pretty much forever. The, on the on the other side, the carbide burrs, those will get uh, to the point if you do a, a full mouth extraction, probably halfway through in a, in a dog or cat, you're going to see that that's starting to get dull and you're probably going to want to change it. So kind of use that as a as a a, um, a basis, because if you have extractions that you're doing and you're only doing maybe two extractions in a dog, you can certainly cold sterilize those or, or uh, heat sterilize those afterwards and use them again after you clean them. Uh, Tracy, the, the burr that we remove the bone on is generally a cross-cut tapered Fisher burr, a 701L burr. And as soon as we're done with the questions, we'll, for those of you guys who stay the whole time, we're going to post a link for the instrument list for you uh, so that you can have all that information. And Isabel, we're, we'll post that at the end uh, after we're done with the questions. Mm-hmm. <clears throat>